your doctors wanted to make sure we got our wedding under the stars. Garrett asked me to read the vows that you wrote before the accident. moment I met you, I knew I would spend the rest of my life with you. Before you, I never met anyone I could be in the same room with longer than a few hours. <laughs> I waited my whole life to meet you. I gave up thinking I ever would. But here we are, better late than never, right? Now that I've found you, it all makes sense. Everything that was once hard feels easy now that you are in my life. And everything that was once easy is now sublime. <laughs> I'm sorry. I love you. I'm sorry I've been so impossible. No, no, you do not get to apologize, sweetheart. I can't begin to understand what you're going through. But I promise, I'll be at your side while you do it. Mm. Mm. And Catherine Fox. Easy. You couldn't be average if you tried. Oh, what's the matter? Get me to that bedroom now. She's back, baby. <laughs> <laughs> do you, Garrett, take this woman to be your wife? I do. And do you, Natasha, take this man to be your husband? By the power vested in me, I now pronounce you husband and wife. <laughs> don't, don't. I know. Thank you. Thank you for marrying me. <laughs> 